This is Jim Houston with Don Taylor. You know, Jim, I love it when hockey games start. It gives me a fresh new chance to redeem myself from all my earlier wrongdoings in previous games. Plus, it makes me giddy as a school day. Looks like you'll have to try again next game, Don. Quint passes it across two lines and play is stopped. Well, with that being the first goal of the game at all, I'd just like to say, I don't know, nothing, I guess. You got anything, Jim? Nothing that would top that. Man. It's one on one. Take it out. Sim. He scores. Jim, I put that goal on my top. I don't know, say 1,500 goals of all time. That high. What can I say? Sometimes it pays to be conservative. Injured, Marshall, he gets pushed off the puck. Manila, Nielsen. Marshall gets bumped off the puck. Shoulders go back. He's a rambling man, Jim, and he just rambled right over that poor guy. Go back. Ben Allen flattens Cheward. He delivered that hit like a cod. Oops. Uh, COD. Hogue bowls over. Go back. Go back. Gets stapled. <laughs> Lukovic. Hoag has the puck. The dead fires it. He staples Menelok. Heavens to Betsy. Is what I would have said if I were an 80-year-old woman. Pompier pushes Hoag. That should be just enough to earn him a D- minus in playground etiquette. Right. Shoots. Shot by Salo Nielsen. Menelok shoots the puck. Grabbed by Store. The debt gets the pass from Store. It's one on one. He scores. That shot cost four or five dentists to run for cover like little girls. Fifth one sadly remains unaccounted for. Cleveland is falling out of the hunt rapidly. They might want to be thinking goalie switch. This goal goes in through sheer brute male testosterone force. That's my dad. Ben Allen will win the faceoff more often than not. Jim, there you go, getting all scientific again. Ben Allen, this shot, Salo, stoned in cold. Gobain gets checked. He's all about the good-natured buffoonery, Jim. Gobain gets ball over. Muller. Van Allen. Muller. Slap shot. Big glove. 
Frank Salo hangs on for the whistle. Salo saw that slap shot coming a mile away. Piece of cake. Bowled over. Last minute play in the first. The deck shoves Cured. Sidor gets hold of the puck. Morrow shot the puck. As a three-goal lead and has been playing magnificently. I openly endorse their brand of hockey. It should be taught in all public schools instead of math. Hi and welcome back. Let me ponder the finer points of this game so far. Is my alarm clock getting picked up by the mics again? Sidor has played one period already, but he's been invisible on the score sheet so far. He's not meeting our expectations, that's for sure. He really needs to wake up and get going, Jim. He's got to juice it up a bit, you know? Hogue gets checked. Offside, Hartford. Cleveland puts its second line out. Nielsen, run over, Van Allen, it's one on one, right, he scores, hey, how pretty was that, very pretty, oh I'm sorry Jim, the answer was exceptionally pretty, Hartford gives up one here in the second. My encyclopedic knowledge of hockey tells me they're now only leading by two. Ganey grabbed it. Flyashenko fires hard. Selmser. Selmser gets pushed. Sidor gets shoved. Selmser gets knocked over. Selmser. Lukovic. Flyashenko mows down Jeward. Sidor gets pushed. Flyashenko! Flyashenko! With a wrist shot! Salo made the save! The debt takes it! Salo with a glove save! That save was big, but not overbearing! Salo freezes the puck! Gets checked. Hey, this guy means business, but without all the distracting office politics. Hartford corrals it. Blocked. Quint picks up the puck from Salo. Shoots it. Kick save. Tron. He gets crushed. Offside against Cleveland. Fires! Score! Denied him! Rompierre shoulders Blyashenko. He came out of nowhere and punished him with power. Menelik gets hip checked. Apparently he forgot about that whole looking out for number one thing. Fisher gets called for roughing. They'll be short one player. He got a little too excited there, although I'm sure he meant well. Pusher, right on! Pompier stops the shot, knocked him off the puck. Oh. 
right. Gardner gets away a hard shot. Pompier plays out Ben Allen. He scores upstairs. I want to point fingers, but I'm going to anyway. The tender should have had that one. Cleveland has fallen three goals behind here in the second. Their coach calling on all his anger management skills now, Jim. Ben Allen gets shoved. He's a one-man traveling hitting sideshow. Marshall. Ben Allen. Marshall fires it. Sent flying. Stuff that in a second, boiling. Ben Allen, her shot right on. Salo turned the shot aside. Ledger levels Nielsen. I like hitting so much, it leaves me feeling spit. Right. Ledger shoulders in. Turned over. Hartford has a three goal lead in the break. Their passing has been pinballed. Jim, and he doesn't even like country music. Tron shoots it! It's two on one! Hogue gets rubbed off the puck. Kicked out by Salo! Gardner! Morrow! Hogue with shot! How's that for a little instant gratification? They're wrapping themselves in victory with every sparkling new goal. Hogue is a real scoring threat out there. He is, but as usual, it takes a team effort. And always does, Jim. Wouldn't you agree? Definitely. Good. Well, can you fetch me a coffee? Scored by number 33, Benoit Hogue, assisted by number 10. Sim whips a shot. Salo closed the door. That's offside. Hartford takes possession of the puck. Salo, great save. Sim shoots the puck. Save by Salo. Did it. Flattens Tron. Not very elegant, but totally effective. Shoots. Salo makes the leg save. Sim turned away. Check from behind. Shoots the puck. Tron takes the puck. It's one on one. Sim pushes the back. Fires it. Check. Uh oh, they're gonna go. Which is too bad because the fans obviously hate this kind of stuff. Oh no, Pa! There's gonna be a whooping. Somebody get the sheriff. Me ha! Five minute fighting majors have been handed out. Jim, when a fight ends and nobody wins, nobody wins. Hartford Kennedy to number 
Antoine Gobert. He gets hammered. It was either that or back over him with a dump truck. Lukovic is going to the box for roughing. They'll be on the defensive again as they take yet another penalty. Van Allen is a face-off king for his birthday's teammates bomb a woven crown. Really? You know, the same outfit I got you. Fires score turns him away. Fisher rolls over Quint. Morrow shoots it, kicked away. Knocked down. Pompier moved it. Morrow fires it hard. Salo made the save. Fisher rolls down Bobin. Fisher drops Bobin. Big hit, Morrow. Lukovic gets laid out. He just made a donation to that guy's charity of pay. The ref indicates a delayed call against Hartford. Lukovic is going off for roughing. That'll put them down a guy. Gardner, one-timer. Laid out. Don't worry, Jim. He'll be eating solid food again in no time. Hold shoots. Salo stunned him cold. Lukovic steps back onto the ice as the penalty expires. Muller fires it right on. Saved by Salo. Knocked over. Stuff that in your knapsack, pal. And so ends another chapter in the great book of hockey. Hartford has done bad things to its opponents. What a train wreck of a game. From Hartford, Connecticut, I'm Jim Houston with Don Taylor. So long for now. Hartford, number two, Gary Fisher. Tonight's second star for Hartford, number ten, Brendan Merrill. And tonight's first star for Hartford, number 13, John Sims.